Welcome to Cyber World YT. Like and subscribe if you are new here. Also follow me on Instagram for in case of any queries. Today we dive into the shadowy world of TikTok hacking and the tools that make it possible. In an era where TikTok has become one of the most influential social media platforms globally, its vast user base also attracts the keen interest of hackers. From personal data theft to widespread misinformation, the stakes are high. The vulnerabilities of TikTok, like many digital platforms, can be significant, and it's crucial to be aware of these to protect oneself adequately. This awareness is where Kali Linux comes into play. Renowned in cybersecurity circles, Kali Linux is a powerhouse packed with tools specifically designed for testing security systems and performing ethical hacking. Throughout our discussion, remember, all hacking techniques and tools mentioned are for educational purposes only. Unauthorized hacking is both illegal and unethical. We aim to educate about potential security weaknesses so they can be safeguarded against. Stay tuned as we uncover the top methods hackers could use to exploit TikTok. First up, we have social engineering. In the vast expanse of the internet, TikTok users, like many others, can become targets of social engineering. This method isn't about brute force or complex coding, it's all about the art of manipulation. Hackers cleverly disguise themselves to gain trust and extract sensitive information from unsuspecting users. They might pose as support staff, fellow users or even brands you trust, crafting scenarios that require you to share passwords, personal data or financial information. Imagine receiving an official looking email, supposedly from TikTok, claiming there's an issue with your account. It urges you to click a link to resolve the problem. This link leads to a convincing, yet malicious web page designed to harvest your credentials. Such phishing attempts are common, and often quite convincing. With tools available in Kali Linux, creating these deceitful emails and websites becomes almost a walk in the park for the cyber savvy. Remember, always verify who you're communicating with online to avoid falling victim to these tricks. Next, let's talk about brute force attacks. Imagine a burglar trying every key on a keyring to unlock a door. That's essentially what a brute force attack does in the cyber world. This method involves attackers attempting countless combinations of usernames and passwords until they stumble upon the right one. It's a trial and error method that relies on persistence rather than finesse. Two popular tools that facilitate these relentless attacks are Hydra and Medusa, revered in the hacker's toolkit. Hydra is like a master key capable of rapidly firing password combinations at a login to crack it open. Meanwhile, Medusa stalks its prey quietly, allowing simultaneous attacks on multiple usernames and services, which can be especially effective if the password policies are not stringent. While brute force attacks are not subtle, they are surprisingly effective, particularly against systems with weak password policies or those that lack account lockout mechanisms after several failed attempts. Brute force is a blunt tool, but effective in the right conditions. Moving on to a more technical method, cross-site scripting, or XSS. Imagine a scenario where a hacker decides to target a popular platform like TikTok. By employing cross-site scripting, they can inject malicious scripts directly into the web pages viewed by unsuspecting users. This type of vulnerability exploits the trust a user has for a particular site, turning it into a weapon against them. Now. How does one execute such an attack? Enter tools like Beef, which stands for Browser Exploitation Framework. This tool is particularly favored in the cybersecurity underworld for its prowess in managing and delivering these XSS payloads. Once the malicious script is injected, it can perform a variety of functions, from stealing cookies and session tokens to redirecting the user to malicious websites. This method of attack not only underscores the importance of secure coding practices, but also highlights why developers must rigorously implement input validation on their web applications. XSS is a powerful vector for cyber attacks, highlighting the need for robust input validation on websites. Now, let's decode SQL injection. Imagine a world where your words have the power to open locked doors, quite literally. SQL injection is somewhat like that, but in the digital realm. It's a technique where attackers manipulate standard SQL queries to control a database's behavior allowing them to view, modify, and delete data that they shouldn't have access to. Picture this, a website's login form where you input your username and password. 
Under normal circumstances, this data helps verify your identity. However, when SQL injection comes into play, hackers can craftily alter SQL commands by inserting malicious code into these input fields. Instead of merely checking your credentials, the database might be tricked into spilling all user details. Tools like SQL Maps step into this narrative with a flair for automation. They help identify and exploit SQL injection vulnerabilities, acting as a master key for databases. With SQL Map, what could take a hacker hours to accomplish manually transforms into a task of mere minutes. SQL injections can expose vast amounts of data if not properly guarded against. Another critical threat is remote code execution. Imagine being able to whisper commands into the ears of a server from halfway across the world. That's essentially what remote code execution, or RCE, enables a hacker to do. This method allows attackers to execute arbitrary code on a server, potentially giving them full control over the system. For platforms like TikTok, which handle massive amounts of user data and proprietary algorithms, RCE can pose a monumental risk. Enter Metasploit, a favorite tool among cybersecurity professionals and ethical hackers. Metasploit provides a robust framework for developing and deploying exploit code. Through its modular approach, users can craft custom RCE exploits tailored to target specific vulnerabilities found in an application's infrastructure. Using such tools, a hacker can manipulate a TikTok server to execute commands that could lead to data theft, service disruption, or worse. Hence, understanding and mitigating RCE vulnerabilities is crucial for cybersecurity teams. RCE represents one of the most dangerous forms of cyber attacks. Next, we explore session hijacking. Imagine you're sipping coffee, browsing on your laptop. Little do you know, someone might be silently intercepting the session where you're logged into your favorite social media. This is the essence of session hijacking, where attackers capitalize on active sessions to gain unauthorized access to user accounts and sensitive data. Tools like Wireshark, a network protocol analyzer, and Etacap, a comprehensive suite for man-in-the-middle attacks, are often employed by hackers to capture session data as it travels across a network. Wireshark allows attackers to monitor and capture packets of data, dissecting them to extract valuable session IDs and cookies. Meanwhile, Etacap facilitates real-time traffic manipulation, enabling hackers to redirect a session's data to their system. Understanding the mechanics behind these tools underscores the importance of securing communication channels, particularly when using public Wi-Fi networks. Implementing robust encryption methods like HTTPS and using virtual private networks can help shield against such intrusions. Always ensure your connection is secure to prevent session hijacking. Now on to DNS spoofing. DNS spoofing, also known as DNS cache poisoning, is a deceptive technique used to redirect online traffic from a legitimate website to a fraudulent one without the user's knowledge. This is achieved by corrupting the DNS resolution process, which is responsible for translating human-friendly domain names into machine-readable IP addresses. Imagine typing in a web address, and instead of landing on your intended site, you find yourself on a look-alike page designed to steal your personal information or infect your device with malware. That's DNS spoofing in action. To pull off such a maneuver, attackers often use tools like DNS Chef. DNS Chef is a highly flexible and powerful tool in the arsenal of cyber attackers, capable of forging DNS responses to redirect users as desired. It can be configured to intercept and alter specific DNS requests creating opportunities for widespread deception. DNS spoofing can redirect even the most cautious users to harmful destinations. Wi-Fi hacking is another gateway for TikTok vulnerabilities. When delving into the realm of Wi-Fi security, one quickly encounters a variety of breach points that can be exploited. Let's talk about Aircrack Ung, a notorious tool utilized in the penetration testing of wireless networks. Aircrack Ung is more than just a single tool, it's a suite that encompasses a range of utilities designed to monitor, attack, test and crack Wi-Fi networks. It works by capturing network packets and then employing powerful algorithms to crack WEP and WPA keys. One might wonder why focus on Wi-Fi when discussing TikTok. The answer is connectivity. Many users access TikTok through their mobile devices connected to Wi-Fi networks. If these networks are compromised, so too is the data transmitted over them, 
including login credentials and personal information. Thus, understanding and mitigating the vulnerabilities in your Wi-Fi network are not just about securing internet access, but protecting all data exchanged over the network. Securing your Wi-Fi network is essential to protect against these types of intrusions. Our penultimate topic, reverse engineering. Reverse engineering is a captivating process where one delves into the inner workings of applications to uncover hidden vulnerabilities. This technique is not about breaking things apart destructively, but rather understanding them from the inside out. Imagine taking apart a complex digital puzzle like the TikTok app. By deconstructing it, experts can pinpoint weaknesses that could potentially be exploited. Tools such as AppTool and Jadex are the scalpels of this intricate surgical operation. AppTool disassembles the app, breaking it down into a more digestible format, while Jadex transforms compiled files back into readable source code. This process illuminates the architecture and logic behind the app, revealing how data flows and where it might be inadequately protected. By understanding these pathways, cybersecurity professionals can devise stronger defenses, patching holes before they can be exploited by malicious actors. Understanding how apps are built helps us protect them better. This insight is crucial, not just for enhancing security, but also for fostering a deeper appreciation of the technology we often take for granted. So let's keep dismantling to understand and protect. Indeed, in the world of cybersecurity, knowledge is the best defense. Finally, we discuss zero-day exploits. A zero-day exploit is like a secret passage that's unknown even to the creators of the software. It targets vulnerabilities that haven't been discovered or patched yet. These are the crown jewels in the world of hacking because they allow attackers to sneak in undetected. Kaylee Linux, a favorite amongst cybersecurity professionals, comes into play prominently here. It provides a robust platform equipped with tools designed to test and discover these hidden vulnerabilities. Imagine a digital treasure hunter armed with tools like Wireshark for sniffing out data packets or Metasploit which can be used to craft and execute exploits once a vulnerability is identified. The discovery of a zero day can be a race against time. Hackers and security teams are in a constant battle, with one trying to exploit these vulnerabilities and the other striving to patch them up before they can be used maliciously. Zero day exploits are a reminder of the constant arms race in cybersecurity. That wraps up our exploration of the top ways hackers might target TikTok using Kali Linux. As we've delved into the intricacies of techniques like social engineering, brute force attacks, and the exploitation of zero-day vulnerabilities, it's clear the digital world is rife with threats. Let's briefly recap. From the deceptive lures of social engineering to the stealthy maneuvers of DNS spoofing, each method offers a window into the hacker's toolkit. Tools like Hydra, SQL Map, and Metasploit, while powerful, underscore the necessity for robust cybersecurity measures. But here's the crux. While understanding these tools and techniques can fortify our defenses, using them without explicit authorization crosses into the realm of the illegal and unethical. The line between white hat and black hat hacking is defined by legality and consent. Thank you for joining us. Remember, hacking without permission is illegal. Like, share and subscribe for more insights. Stay safe and ethical in the cyber world. It's not just about keeping systems secure, but also about safeguarding our moral compass in the vast virtual expanse. Stay informed, stay lawful, 